we were so behind on orders and we were low on black filament that I was like, the hell with it. I ended up just kind of angling everything. Uh, I moved the puller back to a position where you can see that all three lines essentially are being uh, pulled by this one machine here, uh, this one puller mechanism. And again, because these are all the same extruders and they're all using the same uh, mold piece, a uh, custom mold that I had made for these machines, I'm able to use, for the most part, the same temperature settings and the same speed settings for everything, uh, which is super nice and efficient because basically I can just have this puller be at a set speed and I have the extruder set at my you know, desired temps and speeds and all of these lines are running in synchronization. They all are coming about 1.7, give or take, which is what I aim for anyways because I'd rather be out uh, on the lower end rather than be like 1.8 because uh, that will end up clogging the extruders. I'm sorry, the, uh, especially the A1s, it'll clog on the A1s a lot more, but 1.7, uh, give or take, does not clog anything. So yeah, 